Hello, this is Dr. Gay from Forsake MRI, and this is a 14-year-old male who injured his elbow throwing, and he has pain along the ulnar aspect or the medial aspect, which is right over on this side. This is the outside, lateral side, and to get some anatomy, this is the humerus up high, this is the elbow joint, and in the forearm there's two bones, this is the ulna, and the smaller one here is the radius. And on this view, he's having pain along this ulnar side. And in the thrower, we want to look very closely at the ulnar collateral ligament, or UCL. And right away, we see some findings. Over here, there's a band of brightness here. This is marrow edema within the ulna. And there's a little pointy part over here. This is called the sublime tubercle. And this is where the ulnar collateral ligament will attach. And seeing the marrow edema here, it's worrisome for a bone contusion if he had a certain type of injury where it impacted or if there are distractive forces where the ligament attaches over here. This can be related to stress reaction from repetitive traction where the ligament attaches. So there's no uplifted avulsion or displaced fracture, but again, abnormal signal without a displaced fracture, meaning the stress reaction or stress-related uh, injury. And we're going to look for that ulnar collateral ligament. They zoom this up a little bit. So the ulnar collateral ligament is this dark band coming down. And it should attach right here to this pointy part called the sublime tubercle. There's a little bit of increased signal there between. I don't see them coming together. And there's a subtle bright band there coming down, which is abnormal. This is more anterior, and this is what it should look like. It should come down and attach right there, right on the bone. But on this view, there's a little separation where it's peeled off a little bit. And if we window this down, we'll be able to see that there's a little haze of bright signal, increased signal here. Muscle is dark down here, and here's a little bit bright. So this strip of um, increased signal there means it's a periosteal injury, and that is a little telltale sign there, that edema in the muscle that is real finding, and a little band of brightness right there too. So this is a partially torn ulnar collateral ligament that's partially stripped from the sublime tubercle. And there's also stress reaction there in the bone, but again, no displaced fracture or avulsion. And this is a T1-weighted image, and it really doesn't show up very good on the T1-weighted image. This is that UCL coming down, and it should attach over here, but there's a little separation, but it really stands out a lot better on this other image here, the protein density fat suppressed sequence. So UCL partial tear stripped from the sublime tubercle with stress reaction of the um, ulna here and no displaced fracture, and that's it. Thank you so much.